the I do not remember and wow what the I don't oh hello folks welcome back I'm the one I am the only I am the very destructive I am a hobo Tom and again happy beer day Thursday everyone the night swim brouhaha the good stuff baby Ah, that hits the spot. I'm not here to talk about the gloriousness of a night swim porter. But I'm here to talk about pro wrestling. So you know what, folks? Hit mine. <laughs> WWE event this weekend. Um, I just found out about it because a bunch of people were putting up their prediction videos. So therefore, I too must also put up my prediction videos. So hopefully this is going to go up well later. Just have to do a little editing. Let's see here. Got a little switcheroonie here. Yep. Yep. Hmm. Uh, yep. Say yay to this. And, yeah. Well, something screwy happens. So, I'm going to talk about bad blood. So, I just realized I left my official hubbo list. That's which is now the Christmas list. So let's see here. Let's take a look at these matches. Starting probably from the first match. Someone's got to go and go home early. We have... I have adrenaline... Oh, wait, how does that go? Adrenaline in my veins. Yep, we have Cody Rhodes. And... For I am unworthy. I acknowledge Roman Reigns is my true tribal chief. Versus the other clowns from the bloodline. So you know what? Very simply, folks, this is my stone cold lock of the night. Cody Rhodes and Roman Reigns are winning. Yeah, that's that's a pretty simple one. Then let's see here. Let's say we have Liv Morgan versus Rhea Ripley. This is where I think... If they did this right, it would actually be pretty good and interesting. Because I think they're going to flip-flop things just a little bit. Rhea Ripley is amazing. So, yeah, very simply, Rhea Ripley is going to win that belt off of Liv Morgan. And this plays in a little bit to the next match, which is going to be Damien Priest versus Finn Balor. This is where I think things are going to flip-flop. Damien Priest is going to lose his belt to Finn Balor. So you have still have this kind of dichotomy between the Terror Twins and Judgment Knight. So yeah, those are my two predictions. And honestly, folks, this is a match you can snooze through. You have Nia Jax versus Bailey. Um, yeah. Nia Jax is going to retain. You're not going to see all, all these belts switch hands so soon. Yep, Bailey is going to save up. Something's going to happen with Tiffany Stratton eventually down the line. That's all I have to say. And then this man gets the one and only. Introduction, well, of those who are not Bullet Club, at least. Because he is Chicago's own. Wait for it. Um, wait for it. He is 
the true cult of personality. You're leaving me? No, I'm not leaving you. What the heck's going on? Wait a second. This isn't... Oh, wait, here we go. Whatever. Why can't I do this? Why is my computer not working? Let's see. Ah, oh, here we go. Yes. I can say I saw them live. C M Home. And he is taking on Drew McIntyre. I'm torn about this. I think they're going to move on to bigger and better things with CM Punk. Drew McIntyre versus Finn Balor could be interesting. So yeah, we'll see what happens there. I have CM Punk winning the definitive blow-off match. Remember, Drew McIntyre won the first one. CM Punk won the second one. CM Punk is going to win the third one. And that way that sets up things for Seth Rollins. And possibly CM Punk's WrestleMania moment with Cody Rhodes. Indeed. Because it's definitely... He's the only one with... The cult of... Per... Son Ali. And also, folks, this is going to be my match of the night. And yes, and let's see here. So that's that. Let me check something because I thought I saw something. But. I might be thoroughly mistaken. It would not be the first time. Because, again, I am at another job. Job I want to be at. Oh, let's see here. Social. Um, maybe I don't have any new ones. Let's see here. What's social mean? Nah, video call recording, whatever. Coach Patrick already did that. Yep. So, you know what? I don't remember this one. Oh, that's from a while ago, too. So, yeah. I'm pretty good on... I think I'm all caught up, caught up on stuff. But, yeah. So, those are my bold predictions for WWE Bad Blood. So, thank everyone for watching. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. And you guys do not know how much I appreciate you. Thank you for all your patience during this very transitory time in my life. Eventually... There might be someone, well, either there or there. Two of them. Indeed. No, just one. Yeah, I can barely handle one woman at the time. Much. I don't know how people do that. That's too much drama. Other than that, thank everyone for watching. Please.